I'm here at Totem Pole Playhouse. It's a little different than what I expected it to be this time of year. I wanted to show you some of the construction that's happened here. Let's take a stroll down and see that area and peek into the gift shop. I would say about 80% of the work is done. We still have a lot of the fixtures to go in, but the big work, the harder stuff, that's already done as you'll see. This is the area here on the left side of the playhouse as you approach the front. And you can see there's our brand new gift shop, those big glass doors. There's two glass panels and a large glass door. We're coming up on the ramp. That's our handicap ramp. We need that because as you'll see, there's a door with some blue tape on it right next door to the gift shop. That's our new women's bathrooms. Here the door is to the new gift shop. Let's go over and take a peek inside there. Again, still under construction. But you can see nice bright yellow. Oh, the lights go on as we walk in, which is nice. There's the air conditioning unit. It's a rather large space, much larger than what I thought. And I'm very happy about that because it means we'll have more items to sell. And that means we'll have more money coming in, which boy, are we going to need it after this summer. This is the new Carl Schur and Will Love rehearsal hall, which is part of phase one of our construction. It's a beautiful hall. If you haven't been in here before, it's a little messy right now, but uh, much larger and far nicer than the old rehearsal hall. That gray area that you see of curtains from wall to wall, those are mirrors that literally run the entire wall so that our dancers and choreographers can continue to give you those amazing production numbers as you saw in Mamma Mia and Best Little Whorehouse in Texas. It's a terrific space. There are some cupboards there that are gonna be in the area I'm about to show you next. There's a table where our board was meeting last, our rehearsal piano. There's our baby grand piano that someone donated, which was a wonderful donation. We take donations of all kinds. Those are the stalls for the women's bathrooms. And here's an area over here that never existed before. It's just off the rehearsal hall. It's a separate entrance for the actors to come in, so they're no longer disrupting rehearsals when they enter. They have their own entrance. They also have an area over here, as you'll see, there's a hookup for a sink that will be going in with a large counter that runs the full length here. Over there is a hookup for uh, electrical hookup for the refrigerator and a water hookup for the ice maker. Along here, there will be cupboards, both on this side and over here on this side, along with the counter, you can see the air conditioning there. Let's step into yet another room right here. It's small, but it's a separate bathroom for the actors. We no longer have to use the facilities that the patrons use. We now have a separate bathroom attached to the rehearsal hall so that actors have their own private bathroom. Uh, also for when we have classes in here during the off season, they'll have their own bathroom. We weren't able to open a school, which we had planned because we realized we don't actually have a bathroom for people. We do now. Continuing over here, we have, well, we have a set of stairs that was never here before that's leading upstairs to a whole second story that was never here before. This is our new space for the actors to have a break room. When you have 40 or 50 people in the cast, they need somewhere to hang out besides the rehearsal hall. And so they have their own green room upstairs now here at Totem Pole behind the rehearsal hall. As you can see, it's a very large room. We'll also be using it for our board meetings and committee meetings for those committees that are involved in the board. It's a very nice space, nice drop ceiling, LED lights to save money. As you round the bend here, there's a separate area here. That's for changing rooms for the male and female dancers. They no longer have to change at home and come in. They can change right here. So it's a terrific new space, all part of phase two.